What's up you guys? Welcome back to the channel. I know y'all saw the new releases, right? That are coming out soon. If you keep tabs on my stories, then I know for a fact you'd be seeing it. I'm getting hyped for the new Hyper Amplify. The studio's got new colors that they be popping out with. And the Venture, mm. <laughs> So if you're interested in checking out all the new releases that'll be coming out soon, girl, you came to the right place. Hit that subscribe button, follow your girl on IG for all things fitness, all things Gymshark, because together we got this. Love it. Yes, we gotta talk right now. Come on. See this rainbow mug? This is the mood of the day right now. I'm pumped. So everything you see today, you guys, it's not released yet, but the second, the second that I'm able to pretty much mention when the release date is, keep tabs on my stories because I'm gonna be blasting all about it. Keep tabs, girl, okay? And when these do release, you already know that I'll have everything individually linked down below for your convenience, so you ain't gotta navigate nowhere. You just click, buy, that's it. But as of right now, I do have all my measurements linked down below so you can check it out and kind of do some comparing for your own sake. Everything today is in a size small, my true size. And I think you know which collection I'm gonna be starting with. I'm hyped, yeah! This is what bright dreams are made of, hence the rainbow mug. I don't know if you guys noticed on IG, but the Hyper Amplify is getting hooked and there is a reason I cannot stop wearing this collection at the gym. I can't. I keep wearing it and I just, I never want to stop. I love it. I'm pretty sure it's like my top favorite now. Ooh. Shall we start with the Hyper Amplify leggings? <laughs> oh Lord. <laughs> Calm down, Ash. Okay. Um. I'm gonna die real quick because these are the most bomb leggings that I've ever worn in my entire life. Other than the animal that adapt whole collection from Gymshark, Hyper Amplify made it to the frickin' top. They're like new seamless collections they've been dropping. I have to admit, they're starting to become more and more like top dog for me, like even over the vital seamless. Just saying. Okay, so I have the leggings in the light gray marl slash neon lime color. And I also have the leggings in this like neon red color and a little bit more of a darker gray. So both have a really nice contrast to it. The neon colors, they pop in your face. They will get attention from across the room. Oh, but they're still subtle enough where it's not taking up the entire legging. So straight up, like the whole aesthetic of these leggings are so freaking unique and so eye-catching and just so beautifully designed. I, I can't get enough. I'm living for it, really. So these are seamless leggings. They are high-waisted, a nice four-inch band, my favorite. And I'm gonna go ahead right here and right now say that if you love the Adapt Marl leggings, if you happen to like that fit, that material, these are super similar in my own opinion and from my research. They're pretty much made out of the same types of material. So you have polyamide, polyester, and elastane. These are super stretchy. They really are a body fit. They'll just like hug up those glutes. Like they just, mm, they just be grabbing at it. I absolutely love the race seam on the lute. The neon lines, like right on the band especially, because the band is ribbed, and you really have that breakup with the, the neon stripes on the band. Whoa, man. I feel like a freaking superhero in these, and boy do I love, my favorite Gymshark sets are the ones that make me feel like superhuman. Those are my favorite. Because when I'm at the gym, I'm just unstoppable. I look at myself and I'm just like, girl, wow, get it. <laughs> You also have that neon contour swoopy action going underneath the glutes here. So it really just brings that attention where you want it, at least where I want it. You also have that heavy neon rib contour going down the sides of your legs. So you have a lot of color going on on the sides of your legs all over. Even the Gymshark logo, the shark face on the hip, on the left hip, 
is neon as well. The inseam on the leggings are about 23 inches. So if you're a shorty, these are perfect for you. But keep that in mind if you're super, super tall, okay? These actually work for me. They're not too high, not too low. This darker gray color appears to be pretty squat proof on me. I haven't seen any sheerness at all whatsoever, but I will say that the lighter gray color, for me, it was about 85% squat proof. So not 100%, but not totally, you know, where I wouldn't wear it to the gym. I've already worn this to the gym quite a few times and zero regrets. These are super wicking, so no sweat showed at all. And I've worn these about four or five times to the gym. So each time I left looking like when I came in. So something I noticed about the Hyper Amplify, the coolest thing I've ever seen, man, is the fact that when you look at that solid, like the marl gray color, if you stretch out the material enough, you can see the red poke through. That's insane, wow. It's like, I can see it, especially maybe around my quads where the material stretched out the most, or when I bend, like right at the knees, wherever the material's spreading, you can see that pop of that neon shining from underneath. I don't know how they freaking do it. How do you do it, Gymshark? Tell me right now. So you can see it on both of the leggings. So for the neon lime color, you can see the lime poke through. What's really freaking cool about these leggings though, is that they are UV black light leggings. So this neon that you see pops baby in the black lighting. Woo! Yeah, so if you're taking one of those spin classes where they turn the lights off, you're just gonna be a, a shining star, okay? You're gonna be, you gonna be glowing in that night scene, okay? I would wear this to a nightclub. How about it? This is great for a rave as well if you're looking to have some fun doing that. But bottom line is, if you are gonna be partying, <laughs> these are party pants. <laughs> so they do have another like blue and gray color that I just can't wait to get my hands on. I'm waiting for them to come in. I just can't wait because these are so freaking beautiful. Oh God, girl. I'm also waiting on the long sleeves for this collection because they look just as dope as the leggings. So just waiting on those. I didn't want to have you guys waiting, okay? So when I do get those, I will be reviewing them in stories. So definitely follow your girl so you don't miss out. But you already know that your girl got those shorts, right? Yeah, so I got the same exact colors, but in the shorts. These shorts are freaking dope. They are like a body fit as well. They're not loose at all all one bit. It's about a five inch inseam, so it's not like super short, but they're not cycling shorts, that happy medium that I personally prefer, that's just me. Same exact deal, they do not roll up at all, lunged in these, squatted in these, they're good to go. You also have a really nice long gusset that goes straight through, so great range of motion, nice four-way stretch. The ends of these shorts are nice and form-fitting, but they're not over the top where it's like crunching me in, giving me the quad muffin top. <laughs> Nobody likes that. So they're like perfect. If they were any tighter, then I feel like it would be just like mm, a little too uncomfortable, but they are perfect for me. I think they're very comfortable. They don't restrict my freaking movement or anything like that or cut off circulation. So overall, really, really great pair of shorts here. Overall, the shorts and the leggings, I would pretty much give a moderate compression. They're not totally high impact, but they're definitely not low impact either. So it's nice and moderate. And heck yes, I would say they're without a doubt true to size. For me, my size small fits perfectly. The band is compressive enough where it does not gape or anything like that. I am telling you right here, right now, these have made it to the top for me. I'm thoroughly impressed and the design is mind blowing for me. I'm obsessed, obsessed. So I got here two tanks to match those shorts and leggings. So straight up off the bat, these are extremely lightweight feather, feather lightweight, extreme wicking capabilities. The entire middle of the back on these tanks are mesh. You also have a little bit of cinched contour on the back, a little bit of movement contour around the front and mesh paneling down the sides as well. Overall, these tanks are a little bit loose fit, not tight at all, not one bit. And you do have the sleeves that kind of drop a little lower, give you some air where you need that circulation, okay? You just need to air your, your pits out. I do that all the time. These tanks come to a very comfortable length. I personally have been tucking them up into my sports bra because I, I like to wear crops at the gym, especially when I'm working core. I need to see what I'm working with, girl. So these have been really great to just kind of like keep under the sports bra 
it doesn't look weird. It actually fits really nice. I also got one of their t-shirts as well in this beautiful teal color. Pretty much what I'm wearing right freaking now, actually. The bottom ribbed part of this shirt is actually a little bit cinched in. So it kind of hugs you and grabs at you so that it doesn't just hang off of your body. Like the tanks don't have that, it kind of just hangs. But this shirt actually cinches in a little bit towards the bottom. This would actually be very good to tuck into jeans or something like that because it has that form fitting capability. Same exact details on the back and the front, but you also have some underarm ventilation on the little short sleeves here. So if you're looking for a nice t-shirt to just wear casually or wear over a set if you want to be a little more conservative or something to warm up in, then these are great. These are so lightweight and they don't bog you down. So two thumbs up for the Hyper Amplify collection. Yeah. So I don't know if you remember a couple months ago, Gymshark came out with new Studio Seamless leggings with this dope print on the sides here. Ooh, like totally different and unique. I did a full in-depth review video on these new Studio leggings. So I'll have that link down below if you wanna take a good look at that. But they came out with new colors for the season. We got burgundy and we also have the rose taupe. These are very winter-esque in my personal opinion. So whereas the Hyper Amplify is just like right up in your face, like woo, this is more like cozy. <laughs> so the studio is great for stretching, studio work obviously, but don't get it twisted. Like I feel like the studio collection is a little bit underrated in my personal opinion. I feel like you could totally be lifting weights in these. They're a little bit thicker, I'm not gonna lie. So whereas the Hyper Amplify has a little more of that like the wicking capabilities, a little more uh, lightweight breathability. This is a little more thicker, so I do feel like all in all, it would be best used in kind of a studio setting. A little more uh, low impact kind of workouts and things like that, but nevertheless, it still has a really nice like moderate compression to it. I have used this for super light work, but I've also lifted weights in these and they've performed very well. So these babies are a 24 inch inseam and you can't really tell on the camera, but up close, they're a very gentle rib. Okay, you got a thicker rib band about four inches, but then down the legging, it's super, super small rib. All right, a little bit delicate action going on. The freaking contour down the side of the legging, I still don't know what it is. <laughs> but you know what? The first thing that comes to my mind is like, it looks like plant life, like almost like fossilized plant imprints, leaves, if you will. So I don't know if that's true. It's just a jacquard kind of contour, <laughs> but I'm gonna go with that. And it makes me feel pretty good because it's got those yogi vibes in my opinion. You have a very bold under booty contour that kind of thins out as you get into the middle of your peach, but you still have that raised seam contour, which is essential, okay? Because I don't know about you, but like without it, I feel like I have a unibug. <laughs> but with a nice raised seam contour, it's, it's more subtle than a scrunch, but it still gives the effect of the material kind of going in between the peach. And I don't know, man, I don't know where that trend <laughs> came about, but I'm here for it because it does, it does emphasize the glutes. Okay, we can't deny that. These both appear to be fully squat proof for me, and especially because they are a little bit darker color. So I'm not surprised, you know, they work really well they pretty much can perform in any way that you need them to. The matching sports bras are very straightforward, super simple. So you have like a moderate type of coverage in the front, not super low cut, but not high neck at all. You have a very beautiful racer back here with the jacquard design, a lot of that ribbed action. You have removable bra pads. And overall, I'd probably give it like a moderate kind of impact. Again, overall, the studio collection for me is good for just like weightlifting, studio work, nothing I'd be jumping up and down all over, you know? So, there's a time and a place for that. The studio is for my yogi babes. I gotta love the fit of these sports bras, to be honest with you, because the thick straps really hold up nicely. Nothing digs in, nothing's cutting off and making marks on me. It's overall a really nice true to size fit all around for this collection, so. And to go over these sets, especially the rose taupe, this kind of really complements it so well. The pebble pink tank, ooh! So it's got the same type of luxurious feel, just very lightweight, nice long sleeve here to kind of air you out. 
and very subtly, you can't even see it, but up close is where you can see the jacquard type of design, okay? But from far away, it just looks plain, but up close is where you get the surprises. On the back here, you also have a nice keyhole little design, give it some delicacy. You have a really nice heavy, thick ribbed paneling going down the sides of this tank, kind of break up the texture a little bit, add a little bit of dimension, some movement, some contrast, so yeah, great throw over, absolutely, if you're somebody who likes more coverage or, I mean, not even at the gym, but just wearing casually, mad cute. And what's really unique is the logo, actually. Where the placement of the logo is, is up at the top, almost on top of your shoulder. Just there, sitting on your shoulder, reminding you that, you know, you got this, baby. Now we are moving on to my adventurers. I know you out there, baby. I'm one of them. I feel adventurous from time to time. So Gymshark launched a brand new look to their Venture collection. <laughs> ah! Oh, wait till you see this. So, um, for crying out loud, girl, look at this. We are looking at their draw cord hoodie. So it is cropped or full length if you prefer it full length. It is adjustable like that. Oh, so straight up, let's first and foremost, there's a lot to talk about with this collection, but I'm gonna go ahead, talk about the freaking print on the front. This print has got like a tie dye going on with just earthy tones, blues, whites, greens, to make it look like a map. This is just a stunning overall piece. You also have added into this design a really nice like orange outline. This kind of collection is good for the on the go kind of person, somebody who kind of braves the elements a little bit, somebody who uh, maybe walks to work or lives in a city, commutes that kind of way. Um, even though I don't and I work from home, <laughs> I do live in a very like inclement weather kind of area. New Jersey gets some shiz. <laughs> Let me tell you, we just got a over foot snowstorm and I played in this snowstorm with this collection. I wore this exact set and it worked really well because you do have a lot of like water repellent kind of features on here. Helps you in that kind of, uh, that kind of environment, if you will. You do have a nice hood on this and it does have a breakup paneling of that water resistant material. It's got that like windbreaker type of material. So this is lightweight enough to layer up with. So wearing a big puffer jacket over top or something like that. So you do have that nice neck covering here. It's like the snood neck kind of help in case it gets a little windy out there. You're not, your neck ain't frozen solid. Again, all the paneling breakup going on here and right on the left sleeve, this is really cool. You have a hidden zip pocket. And again, with the water resistant material. So if you were to put like a cell phone in here, you should be good. Nothing should be leaking up on your cell phone. This is really great in case you wanna travel lightly and you have a bus card or a key to your dorm or something like that. And you kinda of just wanna be light and not have to carry a bunch of bags with you. This is so good for that, dang. You also, on the right sleeve, I noticed that the hemming, everything was a little bit different with the way it was sewn. At first I thought it was a little mistake. I said, uh-oh, what's going on here? Is this tearing? No, not at all. It actually is a little pocket for AirPods. How cool is that? So it's only on the right sleeve, but you'll, you'll notice that the Venture collection has a lot of little hidden gems, things that you wouldn't see on all their like, other kinds of sets. So there's definitely a purpose behind this one. And lastly, you can see in certain lighting that the Gymshark Shark Face logo on the left-hand side, like your clavicle area, is actually reflective, which is a great feature. If you're somebody who uh, walks at night or something like that, got a little reflective action going on, right? So nobody be hitting you. So to go along with the hoodie, these pants, joggers, whatever you prefer to call them, are dope. The color of these match the paneling on the hoodie perfectly. So this is kind of like a that moss gray kind of color, a little bit of tan with like that tinge, very so slightly green in them. You have a nice draw cord, same exact real sturdy draw cord. You have two protected little hidden pockets on the sides of these joggers. So again, if you want to put something valuable in there, it ain't going to get wet. Again, the reflective logo on the leg. And you also have the water resistant paneling on the back of the joggers. I love this because if 
you were to get like your ankle wet, you know, if you're wearing shoes and then it, you know how it travels up the leg? <laughs> oh man, it just reminds me of when I used to go to school and I'd spend all day with my wet pants in school. My jeans, forget about it. So yeah, so this kind of like protects you from feeling that wet. <laughs> so. Overall, very comfortable. They do have cotton in them. This is for sure like a heavy duty kind of jogger. And I appreciate that because where I live, I need it. So overall, this is a 27 inch inseam. So a little bit long for me, but it's not a problem because you do have a really nice cuffed ankle on here. So it keeps everything just at the base of your ankle. Nothing's fallen down or anything like that. So it works for me. I would say true to size, but if you're somebody who likes a tighter fit, you could possibly size down, especially because this draw cord right here is super adjustable. So tighter fit, size down for me. I like a little looser fit on the jogger. I like to just be able to like kind of hip hop dance in it. So uh, true size for me. So they also launched with the Venture Collection really adorable lightweight crop tops. Again, a little bit of cotton in it. So not something I would totally be working out necessarily in, but so perfect for wearing out and about. So this fit, it's kind of got a like raglan sleeve type of style. So it's got like that baseball tee kind of fit in a sense. Um, it does come hanging down longer in the front and it kind of comes up in the back area a little bit. So very interesting overall lay. Again, it's that same like global map look. They also are launching this in just a solid tan moss gray color and a solid like deep dark green as well. So if you need some solid pieces, totally hit it up, but I just can't get enough of this freaking print. Goodness gracious, Lord help me. The sleeves are pretty long. They come down almost to my elbow. So very comfortable, super lightweight, moves around, super boxy kind of cut. Overall, just the perfect topping on this set to be so casual. Just walking out and about, you got it, girl. This is the definition of Gymshark fashion for me, all right? Not something I would necessarily train in, but definitely like essential for other aspects of life other than physically training at the gym. So out and about, going to the store, getting your mail <laughs> in a snowstorm. <laughs> like they thought of everything, like they're gonna take over the world. So I also grabbed a pair of the Venture leggings. These are so, so, so similar to the ones that they launched last time, if you saw my last Venture video. Um, same exact like cuts, same seam kind of contours. Uh, you have a lot of like geometric kind of seamed contouring in these leggings. So they have a lot of like tight seams at the top, which isn't like your traditional band or anything like that. It kind of looks like a band from the front, but if you actually turn around the leggings, there's no actual physical separate band on the leggings. So you have just a nothing but seamed contour going right up. Super, super surprised that it didn't give me the dreaded CT, the camel toe. In fact, none of the leggings today gave me any resemblance of a camel toe, but these are the ones that shocked me the most. I was like, dang, like I really thought they would, but good. <laughs> so the ankles are very beautiful on here. It comes to an overall nice length on me, not too long, not too short. It's a nice angled laser cut type of ankle and you have the reflective logo on your right ankle. You also have not one, but two side pockets that are open and they are made out of mesh. It's black up against this obsidian green. These are squat proof on me. Again, not something I would totally wear to the gym, but nevertheless, you never know if you need to like bend down to tie your shoe on the sidewalk, okay? And you want that squat proof, I'm just saying. Overall, just like a light kind of moderate compression, nothing crazy, just something I would pretty much wear with a baggy like hoodie or something like that, going out and about, that type of deal. It is very sleek. You can feel that like slippery action going on. So you can tell that this is gonna wick whatever comes your way. That's what it's designed for. And lastly, cause you know I love my obsidian green girl, I got a long sleeve. Ooh. Now what's cool about these long sleeves is the fact that you got some elbow exposure here. Ooh, woo. a little different, huh? I really, really love and appreciate the fact that it zips in the upper part of the back of the neck on this shirt because it does allow my fat head to get into the shirt. <laughs> and when you zip it up, it comes really nice and high. So I, I think this is a really flattering look. I love the high neck, okay? I either need like ultra cleavage or I need a super high neck, okay? No in-betweens. 
What's cool about this is you actually have the high front and it goes lower in the back. So opposite of that shorter, like three quarter length sleeve top that you just saw before. Um, this is overall just one solid color. You do have the split hem on both sides. So to add a little bit of something, something on the sides of your hips there, girl. But overall, this is just a nice little comfy, cozy, long sleeve to throw over top. And again, you can feel like that cotton base. So nice and warm, nothing to go crazy in, just to kind of wear out and about when you on your adventures. All right, guys, so that was it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Tell me, comment down below, what are your thoughts? I wanna know what you think about these collections, which ones you might have your eye on. I cannot wait to get this freaking hyper amplify long sleeves. Just wait. Keep tabs on my stories, girl, because I'm gonna have a lot more info there about everything, about the launch dates, times, swipe up reminders, you name it, I got you. And if I happen to not touch base, again, I know this was just like a brief overall haul, but I try to give as much detail as possible <laughs> without it being about a three hour long video. So if I didn't touch base on something, as always, girl, comment down below, I'll get back to you. Or hit me up on IG, all right? I got you there too. Slide into my DMs. I'm always around. Also, a shout out to Gymshark for providing me with these pieces so I could share them with you guys ahead of time. Also, I wanna quickly note that we have a couple more Shark Miss videos coming. Big giveaways that you do not wanna miss, I promise you, they're, they're huge. <laughs> Thank you all so much for watching. I love you, and I'll catch you in my next video.